We decided to go for it and see what happens. Let's explore Geneva while I share eight tips just for you. Oh my God, stop it. Shoot, so we actually just crossed the border. Had no idea. 242. What, 242 for what, for gas? Yeah. That's insane. Every time in a new country, the first 100 kilometers, I would say, it's a little bit weird because it's, everything is new. Premier, 600 minutes. So I think that says the first 60 minutes, one euro. <laughs> Okay. Wait. You got it? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> there was a big button right there. Big red button. Don't you touch that button. We made it to Geneva. Um, we just parked and if you ever do come with a car, uh, just know that you have to park perfectly inside the lines because if you don't, I was reading that you get a fine. It's hard to find parking that you don't pay for. So this one is about 25 minutes from the main part of town that we're gonna go walk to. We're gonna take Bella with us, so it'll be okay. Hey YouTube. Another thing that you need to know is that if you have an EU cell phone plan, you will get charged if you are using the cell towers here. They have this rule where you can't use the, the roaming free like the rest of the EU. So sad. Okay, bye. Ready? Oh, she's always ready. Squad is ready, let's go. Fucking roll. So, can I ask how much it was? Let's just say that it's a little more expensive than Barcelona. Seven francos, <laughs> which means, I guess, seven euros now for two coffees. Seven euros for two coffees? Yeah. And look, look at this freaking little Toblerone. This, this is worth it in itself, I think. So this will actually be my first coffee in Switzerland. Let's see. No sugar, no nothing, so we can just see. Mm, not bad. Say, it is 3.8 out of five. I bet you it's even better <laughs> with a bit of Toblerone. Oh yeah, that's a nice mixture. <laughs> oh my gosh, if you want to know why he's hugging that tree and why it's so funny, just check out the Slovenia yesterday video. Have you ever just like stopped and like hug a tree? If you haven't, <laughs> please do it. It just feels just connected to nature. <laughs> what did you do when you came to Switzerland? Well, my dog drank from a bunch of water fountains. <laughs> Here on my right, we have the famous jet stream, water stream, whatever the heck you call it, stream. <laughs> Pretty sure it was built in like the 1800s or something like that. I'm not sure, you might want to Google me, fact check me, but uh, 
This is supposed to be one of the top things to see here. Full free. Everything's better when things are free, right? Because <laughs> here, everything is very, very expensive. You probably wouldn't believe that it's like 30 degrees out. Beautiful. And it's September. That over there is Mont Blanc. Now, we didn't come to Switzerland to climb Mont Blanc, unfortunately. It's actually very dangerous right now and all of the mountain huts are closed. So it's gonna have to wait until next year. And in case you're new to the channel, I'm on this mission to climb or reach the highest peak in every European country. So far, I've done nine. We're actually in Switzerland because we're on our way to the next peak. Oh, I can't wait. <laughs> I'm like, I'm so excited to go through it. Oh. No, Bella. No. Bless you. No. 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 Oh my god, somebody's throwing a fit. Oh my gosh. Come on. <laughs> Poor Bella. She's so hungry, she's throwing a tantrum. We fed Bella and peaced out of Geneva. It's a great place to visit, but not with a hungry pup. She's like a toddler sometimes. They can be cute. If you're going to take any of the toll roads, so any of the highways, motorways, you need to have something called a vignette. It's just a sticker that goes up in your dash. And we're actually on our way to buy ours because we just learned that we need one of these. And it's kind of funny because sometimes I feel like the universe just puts the right people in your path and puts you on the right direction sometimes. So we just happened to chat to somebody at this coffee place who said, yeah, <laughs> you know what? You need one of these vignettes in order to do the, keep thinking peajes, <laughs> in order to go on the tolls without getting a massive fine. And it's only 40 francs, so about 40 euros, which isn't that bad considering coming from Barcelona all the way across France into Switzerland, it was over 100 euros in tolls. So we're actually heading back into France, um, just across the border because gas is cheaper. In just one day, we learned so much about how things work in Switzerland. It's amazing how far a bit of research and being open to others can help. Don't forget to subscribe if you found something helpful or if you just enjoyed the video. There's a lot more coming. Okay. What sucks is you pay for two years at a time. How much is it? 42 euros. You only get to use it for like the next five months. Oh well. It is what it is, right? Yep. We've got our vignette. <laughs> we are Zurich bound. Next time we explore a full day in Zurich, the most expensive city, and things get weird. <laughs>